Link 2012. But we probably don't want to. We want to preserve the structure as much as possible. Okay, we already got that. And oh boy, we are still at such high health right now. We just aren't dying. Ouch. Get out of here. in here. Oh, we get, we actually got a, there's actually a hybrid set in here? What on earth? Oh, uh, I want that. Oh, what can I replace? Redstone? We don't need redstone. Oh, come on. Picking up stuff. Oh, wait, where? Potato. My big shop. It's just the regular old guy. Let's go into a safer spot and... In here, nope. Put away our stuff now. I actually think that they're spawning from the other side, so we need to do a little bit of that. I just did. Okay, so what's this actually? So this blade is the same attack damage as the other one. It gives a uh, wither and slowness one. Interesting. To the to the mobs. I really probably won't use that CTM set. Ever. It's not good enough. <laughs> Alright. Torches, though. Man, we need more torches. Lag. Why so much lag? What did I do? Why is it that when I originally came in here, there was no lag? And now that I've been farming in here for forever, there is lag. Makes no sense. Why are these things all named Harpoon when I have been using a Harpoon Gun? Oh, it's a, it's among any arrow, not just Harpoon Arrows. Okay. That name's the Harpoon. It's a safety measure. Especially for multiplayer. You never know what's going to happen. Okay. Oh, boy. Well, let's just light it up a little bit. Okay, we cannot shoot an arrow while that creeper is around at all. Right. The hacker aspect of this sword is working out pretty well, though. It was actually activating a few times there and helping us kill mobs. It's not a completely useless crafting recipe. No, 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 no. Oh boy. Yeah, definitely helping out now. All right. You're going down. Alright, you guys. You guys are normal. Take that. And I really wish we had more we had more torches right now. Oh what? There's more spawning? Where? Where's the spawner? Where on earth? Oh, there's probably, I bet there's one in the stinking chimney. Hadn't considered that. Nope. Alright. Yeah, that was really bad. Alright. Now that stuff that's in here is destroyed. I hope that- No, no, no! No, 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 no! Oh, we could have died right there. As a matter of fact, we're gonna move away for a moment. Just so that way we can recuperate. Okay. Cupid. Help me out here, bro. Shoot me a few times. What is it? Regen 3 for a few seconds? Let's take out some basic spawners out here. Well, we 
wait to go back in and finish up the place. Alright, what's up here? Spiders! Of course, so they really can't do anything except for keep you in the maze. Which was the plan. I wanted players to actually go through the maze. I remember doing this on high so it was really fun. Come on. Give me a break. I'm trying to regen here. Cupid, do your thing! The Cupid's actually a skeleton, which is why the potions are spawning on him. It was not easy to do, by the way. I'm pretty proud of it, though. Keep giving me regen. I'm gladly taking it. Okay, I don't actually know the maze completely. Actually, this one's easy. There's multiple paths to the center. Which I can see right now. Oops. Just gonna light it all up. would blow through the whole maze. That creeper. I'm not sure what he thought he was doing. All the spiders can come down when you find the, the actual end of the maze, though, which is the funny thing. So they actually do hurt you in the end. This is a statue of a knight wielding a... Uh, whatever that thing is, a trident and a shield. So, accordingly, I added the heavy chest plate. Actually, the heavy set, really. All of these are stone slabs. They don't technically exist anymore, so that's why they're like that. Okay, we need to go ahead and put away these items. There's a spawner under there. Oh, nuts, we're out of room. And I hear a creeper. Is the worst. Oh great, I see the creeper. I know it's under here. Alright, let's just get this and get out of here. Rune swords, smite, looting, sharpness, no. I don't need those things anymore. Uh, stamina potion, no. Bats, not really. Rune sword. Unbreakable rune sword, I'll take. That's about it. Alright. No, let's just take a big retrospective of this whole maze to see if there's anything we need. Alright. Doesn't look like there's any chests besides that one. Which is nice. Alright. Let's get out of here. Let's go put our stuff away and move on with life. Oh man, we don't have enough. Oh, we have so many special items. We don't even have space for our special items anymore. That's bad. We're going to just keep getting more of them because this area is not. This area has special items. <laughs> Lots of special items aspect about making things like this is creating special items. All right. Well, we have finished that portion. No, we haven't. We still have to finish up that house. We should probably drop our coins off. So we're not using them right now, and they're just taking up space uh, in our backpack mostly. Actually, we can drop everything off in our ender chest now that I think about it. A lot of the items. Come here. Boom, boom, boom. Oh, not quite. Alright, so we're these are tens. So these are ones, these are tens, and then we have hundreds. We have we still almost have a thousand. That's quite a few. Alright. 
then I want to come over here. Put anything we don't need in here. Oh, we don't need we don't even need that. Why 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 are we carrying that around? Uh we don't why are we carrying that around? Why are we carrying half these things around? Seriously, uh I don't even need that. Okay, we're actually gonna keep seeing lanterns right now. Rune sword. Gonna keep a few with the skeleton skulls. Why not? Okay, good. Put all this stuff in here. Oh boy, we're actually sort of running out of room in here, too. How much can we fit in here is the question. And go on. And keep the Pokeball, of course, because we need that. So for tips, we're going to go ahead and discard those. Fruit we can put in there. Perfect. Oops. Oh, where did our Cupid go? We need to keep track of him. Because you never know where he's going to go off to. Ugh. Crazy guy. Good, we got him. I just wanted to make sure he didn't go into the void. Because I know that that's a possibility when he's around that area. Oh, we don't need to go that way. We can go this way. Yay! Very good. Now we have our Cupid back. And we need to go this way to get in there. Now that pretty much everything's despawned, we can go back to the area we were just at. Oh boy. Still, look at this explosion here. I mean, you can see the rays on the from the, the stuff because it's just such a big explosion. Oy, 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 oy. The tricky part to this is that things spawn despite the fact that you're not in the area. You know, when we're over there, things are spawning in this hallway. And that's annoying. So annoying. Actually, I'm going to destroy this. This is... The creeper spawners are the worst of them all. They're the ones that can break you. Alright. Nuts! Oh, there's a creeper spawner in here, too! What on earth? What sick person? What a sick person. Well, we can pretty much get up to the chest right here. That's the whole reason we came in here. Further falling, depth strider. Oh, I'll take depth strider three. I'll take that any day. Is that it? Was that all that was in the chest that I wanted? Yeah, that's it. I guess we could make some iron ore. It might give us some levels in the end. At that rate, we might as well just use our critical thinking. Oh, this goes out. There's probably something out there. Oh, that just opened. We shot out some XP bottles that we don't need. We do not need that. But thank you, game. All right, and here we are. Oh, spooky. There is a little bit of something over there that I want to check out. Seems like there might be something over there. In the meantime, let's just take down these spawners and get whatever we can out of here. All right, uh, likes, I'll take those. Stamina, no. Cheesy potion, no. Don't need any of that stuff. Sleeping stone, eh, not really. Can't remember if that does anything. Oh cool, these drop things. Vodka! I'm guessing that just that one drops vodka. 
But vodka, what are the effects of vodka? Let's actually check it out. So it gives us speed, slowness, nausea, poison. It gives us regeneration 4 for a little bit, though. So it's basically a temporary invincibility. I want to go out here because, you see, first of all, there's this weird thing right here, which just looks weird. Why is there this thing? I guess there's this balcony up there. What's on the balcony? Nothing. Not even a balcony. Now, additionally, there might be something around this end. Because I remember seeing some spawners. And spawners equal something. I go ahead, explode. Oh boy. Why didn't that. Oh, that guy over there did explode. They exploded at almost the same time, so they sounded the same explosion. Alright, nothing so far. Bummer. We're really going around now. And that's the castle in there. Explode, please. Thank you. And that poor spider didn't stand a chance. I, be I believe this might be the place where uh, the Harrowbrand thing is. Nope. Uh, let's actually go over it. Might be. There is a chest back here. Uh, room, unbreakable room boots. That's a pretty big deal. I'll take that. I'm not going to take the bottles, though. We already have plenty of bottles. And we don't even need potion effects anymore. Like, anything we can brew, we have on our armor. Stone slabs are pretty cool. I almost want them. And also, if you, in case you didn't notice, this was in the shape of the person wielding the wielding a, an axe or, or some sort, some form of weapon. All right. Come on. Go. No more creepers. So we can, we've done all of that in this case. Uh, we haven't explored the very tippy tops, though I doubt there's anything up there. It looks like there is a gas spawner up there, though it's not operating. Probably booze. Yeah, I can almost promise it's booze. Um, where to, where to? It's always where it, where it gets me. There's just so many options as to where we can go next. I know that there's an emerald right there. Could also go to Human Sin. We haven't done that yet. Yeah, look at all that lag on the fishing rod. Not desirable one bit. Uh, why am I even keeping meditation? I guess it's an emergency. But even then, we really don't. We're not getting a lot of items. You just don't need a lot. Okay, let's get through this. Let's get this little portion right here. Lit up. I think, oh, wow, there's something down there. There's something under this tree. I'm most worried about creepers, though. Creeper spawners are the uh, worst. Yeah, and there's one. the statue. Okay. Oh, there's a zombie spawner up here. So if we had gone down there, a bunch of zombies would have spawned. We got the spawner twice. That's actually pretty funny. Uh, I don't know if there's anything under this tree, so I'm just going to light it up. Let's go down now. Since this is probably pretty sad. I like this place. It feels nice. Oh, yes. Thank you, Grupo. And then he here is one of the 
one cool thing. So this is Radiant Beam. Look down while holding this weapon to place to place Glowstone. What? No way! So you can't see anything, but you can place Glowstone, which is kind of cool. All right, I'm gonna replace my TNT with this because this is really cool. I can light up everything. Oh, dude, I love this. This is a great thing. Who, who, I, whose idea was this? Bye. <laughs> okay. Yeah, there's, you get all the cool stuff in this final area. You get all the coolest, coolest items here. So you know how we were placing glowstone earlier? Oh, snap. We have so many great items right there. Oh, it actually works on slabs. As long as there's a block below you. You could probably even replace spawners with it. Don't want to replace chests though. Aha! You can go above water with it. Oh, this is so cool! I just so I just love this so much. I just can't stop it. All right. Anyways, this place is beyond lit up thanks to the radiant beam. Oh, best item ever. So sad. It's one of the last ones. Right, just wanted to light that up a bit. <laughs>